wanted to say some slick shit. That's all. You know what I'm saying? I was like, my 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 early influence was like um, Spoonie G and um, early Kumo D. You know, because like they stood out to me because they had like more complex wordplay and and storytelling. You know what I'm saying? Like Grandmaster Cass too. You know what I'm saying with the storytelling and all that. But like a lot of rap was in the early in the early days was like simple. You know what I'm saying? A well a hit, a hop, a shoe wop. Come on, man. <laughs> and everybody was doing that same shit. Like, yes, yes, yo. That's you know, that that's like everybody says that you start off some shit like that. But like when Spoony G got into like um cruising down the street in the my SL, like holy shit, like yeah, shit like that just blew my mind. And so I, I figured like if I was if I was gonna do it, I wanted to be clever with it. So